Hi there, I'm BC Charles Leeskum. I'm a certified athletic trainer, clinical coordinator, and associate professor of athletic training at Greensboro College. Today we'll be demonstrating how to use a six inch double length elastic wrap in the treatment of a hip flexor, a groin strain, or a high hamstring strain. This is called a hip spike up, and it can also be used to apply padding when an athlete suffers a hip pointer. So we can use a donut, applying it over the iliac crest, and secure it in place. We also want to make sure that we use a heel block underneath the athlete's heel, flexing the knee. That's going to allow these muscle groups to relax. We'll secure the wrap with an elastic tape and close the taping with white tape. As with all elastic tapings, we're going to begin distal, working proximal. We always want the athlete to tell us if it gets too tight. Beginning on the middle thigh, securing the elastic wrap, moving proximally. As I approach the hip joint, I'm crossing over the iliac crest, going around the athlete's waist, and coming down. Again, retracing my steps, creating a figure eight with the waist and the thigh. Depending on the size of the athlete, you could use a four inch double length elastic wrap. And you may be ending on the waist or on the thigh. In this case, I'm ending on the thigh. I'll retrace my steps with the elastic tape to secure it in place to make sure that it doesn't leave and I'll close it off with white tape. Noticing that I'm not using the white tape and going around the thigh because I don't want to cut off blood supply. How's that feel? Good. Okay. So to review, using a double length elastic wrap for a hip flexor, a groin strain, possibly a high hamstring strain, we're going to create a spica, which is a figure eight, with the thigh and the waist, going around, moving distal to proximal, up towards the hip joint, and then working around the waist and coming down, retracing our steps, and then closing off with elastic tape and white tape. Thank you.